Oh, let's go. Well, good morning to both of y'all. So yeah, it's going to be Sour Piggy versus Sub-Zero winner's finals. We get some, I believe it's uh, Gigas versus Jack. Oh yeah, you guys are 13 hours ahead. I was looking at my time. Yeah. Uh, yes, I did. Sleep fest. So yeah, uh, I'm going to get some commentators coming for you guys uh, very soon. If not, I'll commentate as well, but I'm doing some stream stuff in the background. So in the meantime, just hang tight. Thank you so much, everyone. Nice, gonna get the wall here, Sub-Zero. Gonna go for the Goliath Oki. Gonna go for just the big plus frames. There's the tactics here into the low immediate. Okay, Sub-Zero looking sharp here. Winner's finals here, big boy contest. Yeah, 4-2 coming out immediately. Yeah, the big duck. You cannot be doing that, especially versus someone like Sour Piggy. Gonna be the pressure here. Gonna get the counter hit. Yep. Quick down jab into the low. Okay, punish. Nice. Immediate low parry. Coming out of Sub Zero. Yeah, I feel like uh, Sub Zero putting putting Piggy in like an uncomfortable situation with like the the charged the charged moves coming out. Get the down four two, I believe. Gonna get the big, big boy combo. Try to go for the Oki there. Yep, the big back two. Again, this is a winner's finals, so it is out of three. Piggy taking the first game. Going to switch, uh, Sub-Zero going to switch the stage here. I'm not sure if uh, stage played a huge factor, but let's see. Cave and Enlightenment, that is Sub-Zero's uh, favorite stage. So let's see. Let's see uh, how the momentum shifts for both players here. Again, both of these characters are really big, so they're not going to be doing a ton of, like, stepping or anything. So it's kind of playing a little bit of, like, 2D Tekken uh, frame data based uh, and trying to steal turns with, like, evasion moves. Finally reacting to the down back two. Uh, that's something that's, like, very important, uh, especially if the player is representing it a lot. Uh, the, the more you see it, the more... Uh, the more you get used to it, conditioned to seeing it. So, really cool. Yeah, the fully charged move is really going to, I feel like they're going to play a big factor just because uh, Piggy is willing to just block, but the forward forward ones, again, Sub-Zero ducking on wake up or pressing. I don't know. Okay, back four. sub -Zero. Ooh, big. 442 coming out. Bye bye. They're gonna get the conversion here. 
Oh, nice. You can get the down forward one to the full string. Yeah, Sub Zero gonna be get caught ducking. Yeah, and the down back two going to get punished here. Gonna go for the quick buttons this time, but Piggy going to interrupt. Punish. I think that was a, that might've been minus 13. Using the down forward three plus four to punish that. Gonna get the big wall standing four two. Yeah, and these four forward ones are absolutely decimating Sub-Zero right now. Big punish. Okay. Okay, gonna duck here at the wall. Doesn't want to get wall splat. Going to get early release. Going to get hit by it. Oh, wow. I like the duck into the one-two punish. Immediate. I like that. Very, feeling very confident and sharp in that. Okay. He could have... He might have gotten uh, down two there. Maybe. Oh, uh, forward two. Yeah. Forward two gives uh, a lot of frame advantage. Or is it damage? I forget. Okay, zero. Four forward one. Go in. Full crouch. Low. Yeah, the jab. So tricky to play around. Ah, uh, and the rage are. Get that big ish out of here. Yeah. The jab uh, is... I feel like Gigas Jab is really good in this matchup, particularly just because Gigas, again, a big character. Uh, sorry, Jack, a big character, and Gigas uh, having very long range jab. Uh, just really good to keep out, really hard to play around. Big forward two. I love uh, Piggy's confidence there. It's going to be a quick 3 0 from Piggy. Next up, we're going to get Losers Semifinals. Uh, so it's actually going to be me versus Fatboy.